Hi guys, it's Rachel. So today I am doing a Scent Saturday video for you. I know I haven't done one of these in a little while. I think I did maybe two and then they sort of dropped off and that was purely because I moved and then there was Christmas and all other things that kind of got in the way. But I really like these videos and I hope that you guys like them too. So I'm definitely bringing them back. And I'm bringing them back with a fragrance that I actually got for Christmas and I'm absolutely loving it and it is the DKNY Pure Perfume. So it looks just like this. This is the original. I know that recently they brought out a new one, which is the DKNY Pure Verbena, I think is how you say it. But this is the original DKNY Pure, and I got it for Christmas. I actually got it in a gift pack from my sister. It comes in this really, really pretty box. I absolutely love it. And then you've got the 50ml perfume, which is this one here, and then you also got a body wash. So, ooh, and I just dropped it. But you also got a body wash in the same scent. So I really, really like that. And it was one of my favorite Christmas presents that I got. So I thought I would share the perfume with you and tell you guys a little bit about it. So I have the 50ml bottle here. And it also comes in a 30ml and 100ml bottle. The bottle is very organically shaped. I think it's how it's generally described. It's actually a reminiscent of a raindrop. That's what inspired it. And all the bottles are like that. And this is actually made out of 100% recycled glass. And this is made out of aluminium. Both of which were recycled. And I think the point of this perfume is supposed to be... Um, I think I read somewhere that it's like addressing global issues and it's supposed to be one of the more eco-friendly perfumes. The vanilla that's actually used in this, and I'll talk about the scent in a, in a second, but it's actually sourced sustainably from Uganda and it was, um, they partnered up with CARE, which is an international organization and it's supposed to, they, they help the uh, people who actually grow this vanilla and most of them are women. So there are a lot of really good causes behind it. That's not necessarily why people buy perfume and it's not necessarily why I wanted this perfume but I think that it's really nice knowing that there is a good I guess story a good background behind this perfume and why it was made the way that it was and it is nice to know that there are people out there that are using products that we use every day like perfumes and using them and the fact that we buy them to help other people who are less fortunate than us so I really really like that and I think that alone would make me I guess want to support this perfume but it also smells delicious and I absolutely love the scent so I thought I would read to you guys what it's supposed to smell like and I'll tell you guys what um, I think I, it smells like and what I like about so it. the top note as you probably would have guessed is a very nice pure vanilla scent. Then it has a chord of dewdrop petal, lotus flower and Bulgarian rose with a floral heart of jasmine, freesia and lush orchids and then it finishes off with warmth from white amber and creamy sandalwood. So there are some really really nice scents in there. How I would describe it is it's very clean and very fresh. It smells like when you first step out of the shower or when you cleanly wash clothes or sheets. It has that very almost soapy but not soapy. It's definitely not soapy in a bad way but it, like I said it reminds you of things that are very very clean and I think that's how I would describe it. It does have a warmth to it which I really really like but like I said it is very light and fresh so you could wear it every day. This could definitely become a signature scent and it's definitely a daytime scent. One thing I did notice which is probably a little bit of a negative considering that it is such a high-end brand is that the scent does fade. I find that it only lasts a few hours and then I can't really smell it anymore but I kind of don't mind because I'm happy to just top it up in a day because I like it so much. I would suggest that this scent is great for people of all ages. It is light enough that it works for someone who's young and maybe starting off wearing perfume. It still has enough scent for someone like me or someone my age and then I also think that it's great. It's not too candy sweet or anything like that so it is great for an older person as well. So I think this is a very nice all-rounder scent. It is very calming and I really like that about it. I've been wearing it quite a bit. I kind of alternate this with the other perfume that I got for Christmas and I've been wearing them constantly so I really really do like this scent and I would highly recommend it to pretty much anybody because it's not an overtly complex scent so I think that it is great for a lot of people and a lot of people would like it. It's not necessarily super unique but I don't feel like I have anything in my collection that smells the exact same either. It is very comforting so I think that a lot of people would like this scent. In terms of price it is a little bit more on the expensive side. The 50ml bottle 
bottle retails for around a hundred and or hundred and ten dollars. I think the hundred ml bottle is somewhere around the hundred and sixty dollar mark. I'm not hundred percent sure on the thirty ml bottle because I haven't seen it myself in stores. But you should be able to get the thirty ml bottle if not in store, definitely online. So that completes my review of the Pure by DKNY. If you guys have any questions about the scent, let me know in the comments below, and I'll try and answer them the best that I can. Overall, I really really like this scent, and it is definitely becoming one of my favorites. I know I say that about all the perfumes, but I tend to only buy perfumes that I really, really like. There are some that I have that I don't like, but this one is definitely not one of them. So other than that, I hope you guys are all having a fantastic weekend, and I'll talk to you all very soon. Bye!